everybody in here, sitting here in the tiny house, having my coffee. And it is cold, but it's sunny. So I, I just, I don't feel like doing anything. And I've still got to do this, this work thing that I'm doing online for many, a little bit here and there. So the videos might be shorter, maybe a day in between or something like that. Don't worry. Um, everything is fine. I'm fine. The puppies are fine. <laughs> They're playing. I'm going to go outside and play with them with the frisbee. Um, the one that Teresa sent me is still hanging on. So I'm going to, I'm going to use that for a little while longer until there's nothing left of it and then start using the orange one that Miss Donna sent. So I got to go check on the chickens. Um, they've been producing two and three eggs a day, uh, some double yolkers and, I took uh, some over to my next door neighbors so that they could have some and uh, it's just so frigid cold so I'm not really sure what all I'm gonna get done today I got to do something though I got to get up and move because my bones are bothering me and like I've always said if I get up and move it makes me feel better so I don't know I think it's gonna be a puppy day today look at these two they love each other and Judy, somehow she gets out of that little sweater thing during the night. I don't know how she does it, but she's so glad when I put it back on her because it's just too cold for her outside. Oh, this big guy here. What, Judy? What? What? This guy here, he doesn't care. He doesn't get cold. He's got all that fur on him. You're being a good boy, aren't you? <laughs> Look, at they're both trying to get up in my lap right now. All right, doggies. All right, come on. We got to go outside. Come on. Go lay down. Go. <laughs> Look at He just grabs her flesh. He just grabs it and chews on it. Every once in a while, you hear a little yelp. She doesn't seem to mind. Look at that. Huh? There he goes. I knew it would happen. <laughs> you guys. Oh, yeah, this is going to have to come to an end. Yep, time to vacuum the floor. I still haven't got that other carpeting down. Maybe I'll do that today. I don't know. <laughs> you good doggy. Look at this good puppy. I'm surprised she's eaten because she has been throwing up. <laughs> she's been barfing. But she's been not acting sick, so I don't know. Oh, that's what I ended up doing for the water. Yeah, I think that's a decent idea. Well, so Judy has thrown up three times today. Hmm. But she's still wanting to eat. Please don't be sick, girlfriend. Oh, look at this beautiful dog, though. Oh, Judy! <laughs> yep, I'm going to have to figure out how to keep these two separated. Good puppies. I just love you guys so much. And now it's Papa's turn to eat. They take turns. It's so cute. Initially, he wouldn't let her eat, but now they're both eating out of this bowl. So that's progress. Yeah, we're still playing with this frisbee until it's completely of no value anymore. It's a shame that huh, we're going to have to stop this kind of play. Oh, look at that. Once Papa starts getting the heartworm injections. Look at that. Oh, they pulled off one whole piece. I think this is just about at its end. Oh, Papa's got it. <laughs> Papa's got it. What's he going to do with it now? Ha ha, he knows Judy's limits. Yep, once it's completely done for, we're going to start using Miss Donna's, the orange one. All right, Papa, bring it here. He's not going to bring it here. I'm going to have to go get it. <laughs> but they love it. That one whole piece has been completely tore off. I'm so glad they love each other. But it's going to be so hard to keep them separated once he's on bed rest. What are you doing, Papa? What are you doing, Papa? You're a good puppy. All right. <laughs> this is the landing zone right here. 
Ha ha. Papa knows her limits. You're a good dog, Judy. You are such a good puppy. All right. Come on. Bring it here. Come on. Drop it. Drop it, Judy. Are you going to drop it so I can throw it for you? She can catch it mid-air. Good girl. Let's see if she does it. All right. Let's see if she does it. Here we go. Oh, bad throw. Good girl. Drop it. Uh, uh, uh. Look at that poor frisbee. <laughs> Papa had to get in on the action. I could just sit here and watch this for hours and hours. You're a good puppy. Tug of war. They truly do love each other. This is this is a good combination. Oh, Papa. <laughs> Papa, come on. That's no fair. <sighs> I'm going to have to go get it and bring it back over here. Otherwise, we'll never see it again. I just went outside and did some chores. I put a whole new big bale of uh, pine shavings in the chicken coop. I collected three more eggs, uh, all white. <laughs> The brown eggs aren't coming yet. Uh, Mr. Lucas is getting eggs pretty much daily from his leghorn as well. Um, I don't think I'm going to get anything else done today. I've got some thinking to do, and I just, I'm almost ready to shut down. You know what I mean? So, well, let's talk about Papa for a second. <sighs> I've tried to record this three times. I'm just having trouble focusing right now because I was just not prepared for all of this. Um... You know, Papa's a great dog, and he deserves a good life, so I'm going to take care of him. But um, just all of my reserves, <laughs> well, my reserves are gone now. Um, so the vet, I just got off the phone. I think I'm repeating myself. I, did I just say he's got an appointment on the 18th of February? He's got an appointment on the 18th of February to get this all started. It is going to cost between seven and $800, um, roughly. So in my mind, $800. Um, and what I've paid so far doesn't count. That's just not, not part of the process, I don't think. Uh, so he goes in February 18th to test him to see how he's doing and if he's ready for the treatment uh, to start. And um, so, but, but that money, that $800, that's supposed to include everything and they're going to let me break it up. Um, you know, I, I have to pay like $300 the first time, um, and then a couple hundred the next time, a couple hundred, something like that. I don't know. I just, right now, all I see is just dollars going out of my reach. <laughs> so it doesn't matter how much I work or whatever. I, I'm not going to be able to get that much money up as soon, that soon. So I may do a crowdfund thingy. I don't know. Um, because if I do if I do work like DoorDash or whatever, um, I won't be doing videos. I just can't do them both because it takes a long time. Um, I mean, I might do a video here and there. I'm just rambling. I mean, things are going through my mind right now, and I don't really know how to proceed. So um, I may do a crowdfund thing. I don't know. I, I'm not sure. All I know is i got to find a way to get this dog taken care of because he's a great dog and I love him so much already. And what's more, Judy loves him too. <laughs> loves him lots. So we're gonna, we're gonna take care of him. So I'll let you know if I do something, you know, to where people can t contribute. You know, I know people will accuse me of e-begging, whatever. Um, I'm not begging for myself. It's for this doggy. <laughs> So, um, let me just think on this. So, yeah, uh, I don't have anything else to say. And I'm just kind of rambling. So, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video.
Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.